Hi, good evening. I should definitely be in bed right now. It's half two in the morning and I'm pretty knackered. But I just had to get this video done. Um, okay, let's try and gather my thoughts. I'm really tired. Okay, so this is Scott Morris. This is Ed Zimbardi. This is Jamzy. I've done kind of videos with these three together. Scott Morris is a known scammer. He's with this Fireteam One website. And... Um, I might try and add some links and stuff together. I'll probably just zap something up tonight and maybe modify it tomorrow, okay, and give you more links and stuff. But I've done several videos with these guys, Jamzy especially. He's a, he just con constantly promoting crappy Ponzi projects. Scott Morris is he's in a million, a zillion Ponzi schemes. He, he, even, he even admits to being in loads of stuff that's rugged and gone wrong and stuff. And... I've already done a video on Ed, Ed Zimbardi, okay? But this is them talking about the crypto program, mate. I smell desperation here, big desperation. And the reason why I've done this video tonight is because Ed Zimbardi has done something in his group or something or and basically told all his sheeple, that's the only way I can describe it, okay, the, the, the cult members of the crypto program to go forth and find out all the YouTubers who are saying that the crypto program is a scam or a Ponzi or whatever, to go on, on those sites and put positive comments about it, okay? So they've gone on to my a friend of mine uh, called Bullish Friends, and I've noticed, like, you know, there's quite a few people on here saying... Um, uh, you know, positive things about it, okay, and trying to stick up for Ed. And, and you can see them in, in the sort of last sort of 12 hours that they've done this. So clearly the the, the doing as Ed is uh, telling them, here, yeah, this guy, I think he's been on my comments, why don't you ask to interview Ed, Zimba, Ed instead of using this successful program as a way to promote your own programs? <laughs> So I think he just cut and pasted this because I think he said exactly the same thing on, on my site. I guess Silicon Valley was where I should put my money. I suggest using your platform to actually help by doing real research and not thinking you're an authority or something without doing proper research. Four months break even, easy and paying on time every time. Okay. So I just think this is a really... Um, it just smacks of desperation from Ed Zimbardi. Okay, so what I am going to suggest, okay, and maybe I should suggest this in another video, really. Okay, so if you're in the crypto program, right, this is my suggestion to you guys in the crypto program. This is just to test if it's real or a Ponzi scheme. If it's a Ponzi scheme, then... It will fail if you take your money out and don't put any more money in. So what I'm going to suggest to you is all the people who are in the, pon who, who are in the Ponzi scheme, take your money out and don't put it in for a couple of months and let's see what happens. And I think you'll find out that if nobody puts more money into it, it'll all collapse. Because I don't believe that Ed Zimbardi, um, he's doing what he's supposed to be doing. And I don't think there's anyone behind the scenes. There's no people doing AdWords or anything like that and doing affiliate marketing or arbitrage affiliate marketing, whatever he ha he wants to describe it as. So my advice would be take your money out, see how it goes for three months. If everyone takes the money out for three months, if it's a legitimate program, then it shouldn't affect things other than that they won't have as much money to play with. OK, so they won't have as much money to do all of this great affiliate marketing that they do and they won't make as much money, uh, but they'll still make the same amount of profits. They might even make more profits if they're legitimately doing this. OK, because if they've got less money to play with, they can maybe focus on it more um, with what they have got. So take your money out, leave it for three months. And if it's still around in three months time, put your money back in. OK, and if 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 it is still around in three months time, uh, I'll probably be putting my money into it as well, because it'll have proved that it isn't a Ponzi scheme. But I'm willing to to uh, bet all the money on the uh, on the planet that this is a Ponzi scheme. OK, that that is my 
thoughts on this. Uh, I know certain people won't say it's a Ponzi scheme, but I believe this is a Ponzi scheme. It's a complete scam. And Ed Zimbardi is taking you for a ride. Uh, and these guys doing this video tonight is just pure uh, panic stations, okay? Because, you know, there's lots of money coming out of this. You know, when this goes up like this, it seems to be a sort of cycle of where it'll dip suddenly. Okay, eventually it'll dip too far and they won't be able to pay out. And these guys have got to stick to the 25% because they know as soon as they offer less than 25%, which is in their terms and conditions that they can do that, as soon as they dip below 25%, they'll have lost at people. Okay, people won't believe in them anymore. And, and, and the program will just go downhill from there, okay? Uh, and that's the way I see it happening. So take your money out. If it's still around in three months' time, if everybody takes the money out, then um, I'll be joining you in three months' time, okay? But I don't think it's going to happen. But uh, what, have you got to, got, what have you got to lose, eh? What have you got to lose? If you take your money out now... Um, and it's still around in three months' time. Put your money back. You've just lost three months, a bit of three months' earning. If it's earning so much, you know, it just clarifies the situation. Anyway, I am off to bed. It's ridiculous time.